let's do the name Samantha in text art, in Descript text art. So, first let's look at the simplest possible way to connect these letters. Is there any special combos we need to look at? Well, first of all, the TH. This is one way to connect TH in the most standard form, I suppose, but we, there's actually a special combination for TH, like this. As you can see, there's a T and there's an H, basically. They are then connected, and that bottom dash is not necessary, but is optional. You can put that back if you like, but you won't need it. It's not necessary. So let's look at it using that combination, because I'm not a big fan of the standard combination. So S, A, M, A, N, T, H, A. Okay, at the, on the bottom there I had to get really tight, because I just found I didn't have enough room. So let's draw that once more quickly. A little neater. S, A, M, A. N T H A. Now, what can we do here to to clean this up a bit? Well, we've got the A M double combination. A plus M equals equals A M like so. So A M. Um, we've got A N. The reverse of the A M, basically the same thing. Um, that's what we got for for double combinations that we can look at right now. So let's apply those quickly. S A M A N T H A. Okay, again, I didn't draw very well, but we're getting the general idea here. We're now able to reduce it and lift the pen as few times as possible. So we're doing okay here. This T H A on the bottom, let's tighten up the top part. So S A M A N T H A. Now, this is kind of long. Well, we're dealing with a long name, so it is going to be a long word. We could try just fattening it. That would fill a perfect box, but that's going to not look very nice. So, if we try to make it into a character style shape, a box shape, we can always just kind of do it in sections. So we could go S A M A N. That N, we can use that to bring it up to the top. See? That's actually a little much, probably, so we'll want to carry that all the way up to the top before looping down into an N. Some man... Duh. Okay, you can start to squeeze it and play with it, and that'll fit a square shape. Um, what else can we do with this? Well, unfortunately, we don't have any closed space vowels at all. So no O's, no E's, no U's, so we're, we're, those options are taken away from us. The only other options available here that I can see would be going S A M A N. I don't see a whole lot of options here, really. There's not a lot of connection points. We don't have any C's or L's with multi connection points. So we pretty much stick with what we got. I'd say. For Samantha, the best one I can find, now play with it yourself, you'll find better ones, but... You can then go horizontally, like so, that's one, one way to do it, I kind of like that one. The other way is the way that we saw earlier. Sorry, I keep forgetting. At the end, I've got to take it all the way back up to the top. Samantha. Squeeze it some more, I'd say, but get the idea. So the S comes farther, the M comes farther, and then maybe you stay. Say like so. Again, play with it yourself. You should be able to find a combination that you like and a style that suits you.